We're solving a bin at an injection uh, point that is searching which bin uh, should be injected. The container considers uh, the bin type, qualifiers, and selected alternatives. And with all these uh, variables, they choose which uh, instance should be created and injected. But sometimes we may have more than one instance which will be eligible to be injected. For example, uh, we can have two implementations of the same interface. So we need a way to uh, specify uh, programmably uh, which instance should be injected into each class. To solve uh, these problems, we've got NIMIDA notation and, uh, well, um, qualifiers, which is a, a, a big uh, concept, because at the end, uh, name it annotation is also a qualifier. But well, anyway, we are going to start by using a uh, named annotation. Name annotation uh, is used to give an identifier to a, a managed bin. So CDI can look up the instance and inject the correct one. Let's see this in an example. We still use greeting and greeting from CDI. We're going to create another one, which is called Spanish. Sorry, Spanish reading uh, from CDI, which of course implements uh, rings and now returns Hola Mundo. Desde CDI. Cool. Now, our server is still in injected with greetings, but if we run this uh, example, a big exception is from saying that this is an ambiguous resolution. So let's uh, help CDI to uh, decide which is the best instance and we're going to give an identifier to this class Spanish greetings for example and now we can go to the server and say inject greetings but I want the one called Spanish readings. And now, if we run again, Hola Mundo desde CDI is shown because uh, CD uh, container knows that you won an instance of a Spanish greeting from CDI because of this annotation. In next video, we're going to see how to use or how to create our qualifiers.